Well, I've been combing my hair, so the negative charges in my hair are, well, go, go from my hair to the comb, and then now that there are negative charges in the plastic comb, if I stick it up to the water, there are positive and negative charges in the water. So what does that do to the water? So the negative charges go away and the positive charges come near the comb, like this. And when the po positive charges... Do that again. While the positive charges go to the... You're not actually putting that comb in there, are you? No. See, if it gets wet, it doesn't work anymore. Because the negative charges have just been washed away. Let me try it again. Okay. Wipe off my comb. Comb my hair a little bit. Wait, wait. Okay. Wow. That is just wild. That's good. You got good video of that. Okay, now what it's doing is the positive charges are pulling towards the negative charges in the comb. And that makes it so they can combine pretty much and make more water, but it can't because it's plastic. So it just. What do you mean, make more water? It's trying to combine with this. Oh. So if I get it wet, it doesn't work anymore because it's just been washed into the water and now it's part of the water. I see. It pulls all the negative and positive out. Yeah. But when you brush, when you comb your hair, that. Puts a negative charge on the comb. Yep. And then when you put it next to. Well, that isn't that good because I just combed it for a little bit, but it's pulling. Absolutely. Absolutely. That is just absolutely amazing, son. What kind of science is that? What? So, what kind of science is that? It's not science, but just like you think. Well, no, I don't know what the hell it is. What do you call it? It just charges from your hair to the faucet. Water. Okay, well that's absolutely amazing. Alright, bedtime.